Hey guys, so let me show you how to install and then run the progressive summarization smart block in Rome. So first of all, I've copied over my uh, literature notes for Storyworthy, or at least the first uh, few paragraphs of it, so I can demonstrate how this works. Uh, second, I've created a summary page that I'll show you in a second. I've already installed Rome 42. Uh, so you can go to rome42.com to ins get the installation instruction. So here in Rome.js, you can see uh, it's actually uh, up and running. And I need to download the uh, smart block JSON uh, from my blog post. So if you come to my blog and you open up uh, the article about progressive summarization, if you scroll down, here uh, at the uh, smart block, uh, I have a link to the JSON file. So if I click on this, uh, that's going to download it. I open it in the download folder and I open uh, the zip. And within the zip, I have a template folder and I have the summarization JSON file. So I come back to uh, Rome and here I click import files and I choose the freshly downloaded uh, summarization JSON file. So if I come here, I double click and then I click import files. Then you can see that the template was uh, imported. So it's right here. Uh, it was uh, nicely imported. And if I now come back to my main page, I click on uh, the summary page. And what I need to do here is I need to uh, enter the name of the page, so the literature note that I want to create the summary for. And I nest a block under it, and I just simply execute the summary script. I'm prompted with two questions. First, the separator between highlights, I'll leave it default for now. And the other is if I want to remove the bold from the text, for now I'm going to say no. When I run this, what you can see here is that uh, the bold text, for example, for honesty is attractive, uh, remained, as well as in this paragraph, I had two highlights and it, in between I have the dot, dot, dots. Also, you can see the references here and you can see the references on the right hand side have appeared. Now, if I come here and do this again, but with different settings. So again, let's just uh, select uh, my literature notes. I nest my summary block under it and I run the script. And this time, instead of dot, 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 I'm just going to simply have space and I'm just going to remove the bold from the text. So then what you can see uh, in the output is uh, here in the first paragraph between uh, foolish moments and honesty is attractive. I no longer have the dot, 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 and also uh, honesty is attractive and the other bold texts uh, have not been bolded. Uh, you can again see the reference and now these uh, blocks are referenced twice. So hopefully uh, you found this uh, introduction helpful and enjoy progressive summarization in Rome.